All right, guys, let's see how we can solve question 55 from the second chapter of the Peer and Johnson textbook, Engineering Mechanics. And we have these two forces of P and Q that are applied, as we can see. And we know the whole connection is in equilibrium. And by equilibrium, we mean that sum of all forces has to be zero. And we know the force P is 500 pounds, force Q is 650. And we have two unknowns in here, FA and FB, which are the forces exerted on the rods a and b so we're looking for the magnitude of these two forces and uh, we have sum of all forces equals zero but since we have two unknowns in here we need at least two equations in order to find this so let's call our x and y in here like this and if we do that we can do sum of all forces in x direction equals zero and sum of all forces in y is equal to zero so Two equations we should be able to find all the unknowns that we have in here so let's start with the x component of each uh if we look at the q we'll see that these two will be the x and y component of q the x is sine of the angle 40 degrees since we have the angle with y axis the x component would be the sine of that angle so we have q times sine of 40 uh our p's already in y directions and we also have fb to the right so positive minus fa and no this will be the x component of fa and this will be the y and since we have the angle with x axis it will be cosine of 50 degrees it will be equal to zero if we look at this we'll see that we have both unknowns in here so we cannot find our unknown in here but if we go with y we have fa sine of 50 degrees since it's upward minus p is equal to zero minus p minus q this time cosine of 40 degrees would be the y component equals zero and here we can find fa which will be p plus q cosine of 40 degrees divided by sine of 50 degrees and we know p is 500 pounds and q is 650 so we should be able to find fa so 500 plus 650 cosine of 40 and we're going to divide that by sine of 50 so our fa would be 1302.7 pounds so we found one of the unknowns if we just plug this into the previous equation, we should be able to find the FB as well. So we're going to go with this equation. We have Q, which was 650 times sine of 40 plus FB, which is our unknown, minus FA, 1302.7 times cosine of 50. That will be equal to zero. So our FB in here would be... 1302.7 cosine of 50 degrees minus 650 sine of 50. So minus 650 sine of 40 and our FB would be 419.55 pounds, which would be the magnitude for the force FB and the final answer for this question. Hope everything was clear. Let me know if you guys have any questions. We're covering three different textbooks for engineering mechanics in this channel. Feel free to check out, check out the playlist and let me know if you have any specific problem that you want me to solve in the previous videos. And you guys take care. I'll see you in the next one.